You're probably already familiar with the concept of arraying objects in AutoCAD LT, arranging them in regular patterns, either based on columns and rows, or rotating them about a point. Now, arrayed objects are associative, meaning they maintain their relationship with one another after you complete the command. This makes it easy to add or remove columns or rows for rectangular arrays, adjust the fill angle for polar arrays, or change the spacing of objects. Contextual ribbon tabs, along with multifunctional grips, make it clear which options are available. Another feature of associative arrays is the ability to replace individual items while maintaining the overall associativity. You can even remove items entirely, yet retain the ability to easily adjust the pattern. The Path Array option enables you to arrange items along an object like a polyline or spline, specifying either the total number of objects or the distance between them. If you modify the path object, the array updates as well. During this process, the spacing between objects stays constant by default, adding or removing objects as necessary to fill the path. But you can change the array's properties to instead keep a constant number of objects while you modify the path. 